Philip Muster, Simmons, the Los Santos County Fire Department. Hey, this is Miles Irvin. You just called me a few seconds ago. Yeah, Mr. Irvin. Uh, I was wondering if you have some freedom time today, if you guys can uh, come down and give a quick mechanical inspection of our uh, fire trucks at our new station and a station out in the county and possibly wash them. Okay. Uh, which one did you have in mind first? Uh, well, where are you located? Are you out in the county or are you in the, the city? I just pulled off of the uh, Snore Freeway exit in the Grapeseed, so I'm in Grapeseed right now. Okay, if you want to head up to Polito, uh, Station 1, it should be Postal 1042, just across the street, uh, essentially from the Sheriff Station up there. Um, there should be an engine and a medic unit. You can just let them know that uh, Mr. Musterson sent you up there to uh, just do a quick mechanical inspection and a wash. And then uh, just let me know when you get that completed. And when you get down in the city, just let me know and I'll, I'll give you the station down here. Okay, uh, so I'll go up to Polito right now. I know, I think I know which fire station you're talking about. And then I'll do the inspection there, and then I'll make sure they're clean. And then after that, I'll just call you back, okay? Okay, not a problem. I appreciate it, sir. Yes, sir. So we got our first job of the day. Uh, we are going to Polito to uh, inspect and wash the fire trucks there. So basically, as far as inspections go, I'm just going to check the lights, check the QR codes with the computer. That'll be smart. It's really weird having to follow all the traffic laws, because normally when I'm driving in the game, Five times out of ten, I want to actually get caught, so I don't actually drive the uh, speed limit. Uh, but for now, I'm making sure that I'm going the speed limit and checking all the lights and following all the directions on the road, etc., etc. Hello, gentlemen. Okay. Sir, you have a spider on your foot. I want to jump and get that spider out. Oh, me? Oh. Yes, sir. Yeah, there you go. How you doing? How's it going? Hey, uh, my name's Mr. Miles. Mr. Munterson sent me out here to uh, make sure that your fire trucks are all good to go. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're right over there in the bay. Okay, just give me a few seconds. I need to get something out of my truck. Okay. Ah! I can't type anything today. Put my hat on. Close my door. Where'd you say it was, sir? Okay, cool. I'm sorry? Where'd you say it was? Oh, on the base. Right this way. Yes, sir. I'm following you. How you doing today? I'm alive. I'm kicking. Oh, yeah? Right here. Oh, here they are. Go ahead and take care of what you need to take care of. I just uh, spoke with Jacob, so, or uh, Mr. Busterson. Yeah. Uh, alrighty, gentlemen. I should be out of here in about 10 minutes. Alright, cool. No problem. Are the keys on the wall here? Yeah, keys should be in there. Okay. Yeah, we always keep the keys in there just so they're ready. Yeah, I see them. Thank you. Okay. Uh, this this one's good to go. All I need to check now is the engine. Are you you said you needed to mess with it a little bit? No, no, I'm good. You're good. Okay, perfect. Uh, the only thing uh, I'm gonna put in a report for, just so you gentlemen know, the um, the hood latch on here actually opens up the stretcher mechanism in the back. Um, so what we're gonna try to do is we're just gonna order a actual lever that says uh or that's labeled stretcher mechanism. And then I'll just come back and reinstall it in a few days. Uh, okay, just yeah, to that's... mitigate any kind of confusion, you know what I mean? Yeah, I know. Uh, we were told about that. I think they had a uh, memo put out that one of you guys were going to come take a look at it. Yeah, well now now I just put it in my, uh, in my report, so hopefully that'll come to you guys soon. Okay. So, uh, take a look at the engine. How's this one been running? Uh, it's pretty good. I 
drove it up here from the new uh, station down in the city. Did you get this replaced, uh, the oil and the brakes, when you got that one replaced, or is this a one on a different schedule? I think it's on a different schedule. Um, I know it's uh, recently serviced, so. Signal 33 is now in effect. Okay, uh, let me take a look. I think that about does it. They don't look dirty, uh, the trucks. Yeah, I like to keep them clean. Yeah, Mr. Munsterson asked me to clean them if they were dirty, but uh, I'm going to assume that they don't need it for now. Uh, I, had to, uh, I had to probably over here clean them. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see the watermark right there. Yep. Yeah, uh, they're all fit, fit as a fiddle. Uh, they're all good to go for you today, gentlemen. Uh, you said you needed me to do some paperwork upstairs. Oh, no, I was doing paperwork upstairs. Oh, okay. Well, gentlemen, uh, I'm going to finish up my report in my truck, and then I'm going to give it over to Mr. Munsterson. Sorry, as I mentioned, I'll have a switch on the way for that one. And then for the uh, actual engine, uh, your oil date's coming up soon, another 1,500 miles, and then we're going to have to replace your oil again. All right, no problem. All righty. Any questions, gentlemen? Nope, that'll be it. All righty. You guys have a good day, okay? You so I just delivered the uh, police car, and now we are actually on our way to another call, which is a orange motorcycle. Let's go talk to them. Jeez, this car looks like it's in some bad shape too. Oh my god. You're so cute. Look at you in your little yellow vest. You look adorable. <laughs> Yeah. Excuse me, you, gentlemen. Hey, how you doing? Hi, heard something about an orange bike. I'm from DB Towing. Oh, that's right, that's right, right over here, my friend. I assume that's the one. That's it, that's it. What about this gray car right there? What's that for? Uh, that that's a uh, local. Oh, okay. What? And that I'm assuming that truck's a local too. Officer. Yes, sir. Deputy, okay. Deputy. I'm, I might be able to get rid of all three of hey, these for deputy, you, sir. Deputy, before he I takes be... my bike, can you get Give the chicken sandwich second, out of the seat? Hey. Chicken sandwich. On one second. Can I... you please get the chicken sandwich if you, out of the seat? If you stop talking, I'll consider you. Oh, my goodness. So, um, this car right here is a local. Uh, that truck over there is a local. So, what I'm going to do is we're gonna get rid of the local cars first. I'm gonna back my truck up over there. Hey Chief, uh, if you could just give us a few minutes, we just need to take some photos and just document like a few stuff. It'll, it'll just be a few minutes so you can grab the bike. Okay, sure, I'll stay out of your way. If you way. don't mind. I yeah. appreciate it, man. No worries. Just come get me. Gotcha. And then I'm actually going to get rid of this car for him. Enjoy that. Oh, yeah, I know. So how's your day going? Hey, Chief, uh, you're good to go to tow the bike. Appreciate you waiting, man. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Yep, thanks, man. Uh, do you need a water or anything? Uh, no, I'm okay. You're good? All right. Yes, sir. Awesome. Thanks a bunch.
Yeah, no worries, man. Thank you. Take the bike. And, uh... Or the uh, owner told me that these things don't tow. Uh, so what I'm gonna have to do... I'm gonna have to do it like that. I can see if it'll tow. I'm gonna guess that it won't. Yeah. Uh, so... Back to, um... F6. And then I'm gonna impound it, which which deletes it off of my screen for now. And then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go in the car. Then I'm gonna add a extra option onto it. Which makes it look like a car is on there. And then uh, last but not least, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, clear this truck out of here. Okay, sir, is this going to uh, your guys' impound or LSPD's? Uh, that's gonna be uh, Sheriff's Office impound, yeah. Okay, I'll take it there. All right, I appreciate it, man. Yes, sir. Is that all you needed from me? Uh, yes, sir. Yep. Have a good day. Thank you. You too, man. Okay, so we're currently en route to a another call I just got called by dispatch. Uh, something about some emergency vehicles down in Mirror Park. I already set the postal code, and now we're going to just uh, head to it really fast. I told him I would get there in about six minutes. I think I'm going to get there a little bit earlier than that, but... Oh my god! Signal 33 is now in effect. Well, this just got real interesting. That went from picking up some emergency vehicles to some guy getting shot. Sir, are you witness to the events that this happened? I don't wanna... <laughs> I don't wanna talk to him. I'm gonna stay in the truck. <laughs> I'm not even gonna... I'm not even gonna try to... Try to mess with anything, because... They said something about some emergency vehicles. And the next thing you know, I'm I roll up and somebody got shot. So uh That's gonna put a delay on a few of my things for a little bit. The helicopter's here. Boy, this is a big scene. I just walked right in the middle of it, and I have nothing to do with it. So right now, what it looks like, it's, um... They're getting... They're gonna get that guy who got shot transported. And then after that, uh... I'll see what I need to do. But for right now, I'm just hanging out here in the truck. I don't wanna... 
I don't want to go to anybody. I don't want to mess with anything. I don't want to touch anything. I just want to sit here and do my job. <laughs> Can I, uh, can I help you? I'm here with DV Towing. Yeah. I was called here by the uh, San Andreas Communications Department. I'm just oh. waiting until everything clears up and then uh, someone can tell me which car to pick out. Okay, one second. Yeah, my truck says DV Towing and I'm here with Amber Lights, but no, you have no idea what the hell I'm doing here, right? Okay. Okay, we're gonna need that silver, uh, or gray sports car taken out of here. Okay, uh, do I take it to, uh, LSPD's impound lot, or the sheriff's office's impound lot? Uh, LSPD. You got it. And then, just, uh, wondering, do you guys, uh, happen to carry, like, spare tires on board? I didn't think so, but... Uh, is your tire flat? Yeah, I already used my spare tire yesterday. That's the problem. So you know what kind of tires you got? Yeah, let me uh, let me see. <coughs> I think there are. Uh, I think there are uh, two, maybe three fifteen. 55 R 19s and this maybe 20s. This one's flat right here. No, the one in the front right passenger side is flat. Yeah. Oh, yep. That's okay. why that guy was, well. <laughs> right. He yeah. shot my tire and then. Oh, sure. You know, yeah, I, I, it is what it is. I get it. Then he pulled a gun, so. But, yeah, that's why my tire is flat. For uh, the second time in the past two days. Tell you what, uh, let me load up this car here and then I'll see if I have any spare tires in the back that fit that, okay? Alright, appreciate it. Yeah, well, chances are it was either in his car or he had it on him because... Uh, okay. Perfect. Because this is his house, so... No, oh, okay. Actually, the one where that explorer... Oh, uh, we got this on. Okay. I'm gonna back up and see if I can find a tire for this deputy, or, I'm sorry, this officer. I think it's your lucky day, pal. Oh yeah? Oh yeah. Oh, that's great. Let me pull away from the curb just a tad bit so we can work. Sure. Oh my gosh, it is bare rim. There we go. Okay, let me set this down real quick. I got my kid here. Oh, you got one. That's probably better than mine. Got a drill on there and everything, I bet? Uh, not a drill. Hey, how's it going? How you doing, sir? Good, are you at DV Towing? Yes, sir. Okay, uh, the medic asked me to see if you could possibly uh, tow that ambulance when you're ready, whenever you get a chance. This ambulance? Yes, sir. Yeah, I can do that. Okay, appreciate it. Uh -huh. Yeah, look, there's a little bullet hole right there. 
Oh boy. I tell you. You know what's the best part? That's the same tire. Same tire that got uh, popped two days ago. I still don't know how that one happened. You said two days ago? Yeah. So that was the brand new spare. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess you're going to have to make a report about this. Um... Possibly? Yeah. Not really, because we're, well, depends on the guy if the survive, uh, depends on if the guy survives surgery. Which, my phone just. He did. So, um, unfortunately, that is, I think it was, uh, I don't know, not all there in the head, so. You're talking about the gentleman right there? Yeah, well, no, the guy who shot my tire. Who is now dead. So. It's unfortunate, but you do what you have to do, I guess. Yeah, it's a tough job you have. I'll give you that. Especially today. Okay, let me just tighten this down. Yeah, I saw one back there. I'm like, this guy's not going to believe it. Oh, yeah. I, w I was expecting, I thought I had a donut, but I actually had a full tire. Which oh, that's good. Which normally doesn't happen, you know, but I was actually at a, uh... I was at another scene today for a Ford Explorer. And so I had a oh. tire from that. Okay. Okay. Is that a new tire, or am I going to have to go get, you know, a new set put on at the station? I know it's not new. I don't know how old it is, though. I, I oh. would recommend going to the station and uh, and putting it a new one on. Okay, well, I'll probably do that then. Alrighty, sir, is that all you needed? That's all I needed. How much I have? Uh, just put it on your report, and then uh, basically we have contracts with the LSPD. And then uh, oh. they'll just... After your report, I guess they'll either take it out of your paycheck or pay it themselves. I don't know, but... Uh, that, that's okay. why I asked if you filled out a report on it yet. Oh, oh. Well, no, no, not yet, but all right. Yeah, uh, so under the report, uh, I have to make one too. I'm going to check the uh, reuse of reclaimed materials part, which basically means that I had a tire already and I didn't have to buy a new one. Uh, so, you know, hopefully no charges, you know what I mean? Yeah, well, a couple minutes of work there. Must be interested in doing that. I guess so. Alrighty, sir. All right. Drive safely. Around. Appreciate it. Let me know if your tire pops again. <laughs> okay. Um, so I have this car and I also have the ambulance. Uh, regarding the ambulance specifically... Um, Hold on one second. I'm actually, hey, excuse me, sir? Yes, sir. Uh, when you guys are able, can you take that um, this medic unit right here with you yes sir i'm working on it right now okay thank you very much you have a wonderful night okay absolutely you as well all right i'm back andrew what's up now i'm gonna pull up here and i don't have room for both the cars on my on my truck here so what i'm gonna do instead is uh is uh, DV it or just delete it from the game? Uh, I would take it if I had a uh, room on my truck, but I just don't. And they still need this out of here, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, DV it. Which is called impound here. But, uh, we got the ambulance done. Got the, uh, we got that done. So now all, I'm, all I have to do is uh, take this car over to the, uh, to the impound, then we are good.
Let's take a look here. Hey guys. How you doing? How you doing? Hey, um, so she's nothing visually, it's just her car just started stop her car stopped working out of nowhere, so I don't know if you guys have a kit to fix it or if you guys can fix it. What year is your car, ma'am? Uh nineteen something? It says here nineteen ninety two, or last time I checked. Or with the to the cat. Okay, so it's not gonna have a uh, computer on board, so I can't scan the computer, but I can take a look no. and see. It only has one one dial in it, actually. Has it has a speedometer? Uh, let me take a look, see what's wrong. In was it making any weird noises before it stopped working? It was, it was puffing and chugging. It was puffing Up and to, chugging. It was yeah, it was puffing and chugging. It started down <coughs> kind of near the sixty eight. Near the beginning of '68, and, and then we got here, and I don't, just don't think it could take this hill. When did it start smoking? Uh, '68. Or about '68, okay. And uh, how much gas did you have in your car before it started uh, stuttering? Um, well, I told you I, I only have one spot or one dial, so I'm not sure. So it it doesn't tell you how much gas you have in the vehicle? Oh, not at all. Okay. Well, uh, let me take a look real quick. Let me see, uh, let me see and what you're the You're free to get is. inside and try to turn the key if you want. Thank you. Okay, uh, I think I figured out the problem, ma'am. Mm -hmm. It's your radiator. Do you know what that is? Isn't it that thing right there in the front with the fan? Yep, yep, that's it. Uh, so basically it seems to be malfunctioning due to its age. Uh, thankfully, oh. the good thing is that it's not leaking any coolant, which is the fluid that goes in and out. Uh, which uh -huh. is a good thing because it, that stuff is toxic. Uh, however, uh, you need to get the radiator replaced uh, before your, uh, and also your coolant replaced before you uh, try to run the vehicle again. Because the reason why it's smoking right now is because it got overheated. Oh, uh, how much does that cost to do all that? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, I would just have to take it to the, uh, to the mechanic and let him figure it out. Uh, oh, there's... Do you give, uh, do you give rides? Cause this is the only... Yeah, I can give you a ride. Okay. Uh, where, is there a specific mechanic shop you want to go to, or...? Um, it doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, the nearest one to us right now is... Lie Wheels and Sandy Shores. Sounds good to me. Actually, I lied. Uh, the closest one is uh, Los Santos Customs, but I can take you to either one. Doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, let me put the hood down. Let me secure it. Uh, let me get it on the truck if you wouldn't mind standing back a few feet. And then after that, I'll give you a ride. Thank you. Let's see. Hey, um. Yes, sir? What's it called? There's something going on in Sandy involving guns or a gunman. So that's. can you guys not go through there? So probably okay. go another, going through another route, or okay. go to another mechanic shop, please. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll just take her to the one in uh, Harmony yeah, on yeah, Route 60. Okay. Cool. Cool. Sorry for the convenience. Yeah. There's just some stuff. Oh no! I don't want to get shot. <laughs> no, thanks for telling yeah. me. <laughs> See here. Uh, this car is actually. Uh, busted, busted. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna straighten it out uh, like that, and then I'm going to uh, to tow it. So I'm gonna get back in the truck. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and secure it for a uh, for transport. Oh my god, she thick. I didn't know she was so thick. Look at all that butt. Okay, strap down. Books on. Hey, uh... Um, oh. Yes, sir. Oh, fuck, I gotta go. Hey, uh, what's your name? Tell man, what's your name? 
I'm, I'm sorry, what'd you say? What, what's your name? Miles Urban. Miles Urban, okay, thank you. Okay, ma'am, you ready? Yeah. Hey, he left in a hurry. Yeah, he said something about, uh... Having to go in a hurry. I don't know where he's going, though. Well, this is what you've been, uh... This all you do, sir? Just tow stuff? Uh, tow stuff, unplug stuff, plug stuff back in. Pretty much. Sounds pretty, uh... Non-eventful, I guess.